everyone, welcome back. I am so excited to share that we are getting new Disney animated series on Disney+. Plus. I previously spoke about these rumours in my Investor Day video and I am so happy that they turned out to be true. The first series is called Baymax and it is obviously a continuation of Big Hero 6 the movie. The focus will be on Baymax's original protocol which is to be a nurse robot. In each episode we will meet a new character who will be a patient which Baymax will help. It was revealed that in this series Baymax will have a new feature which will allow him to transport around the city easily. It will be released in 2022 and it will feature computer generated animation. I'm really surprised that they're doing this considering Big Hero 6 already has an animated series. The second series is Utopia Plus which will be a short form series. It will feature animals that we briefly met in the series including Fru-Fru, Gazelle's Tiger Dancers and Flash the Sloth. We will get insight into their lives through the lens of Zootopia's hottest shows. These shows are The Real Mouse Wives of Little Rodentia, So You Think You Can Prance, and a show that follows the fast lane of life at slop speed. They will be released in Spring 2022. I think the reason why this is a short instead of a proper series is because we are getting a Zootopia sequel, fingers crossed. The third series is called Tiana and it is of course based on The Princess and the Frog. The series will feature Tiana stepping into her role as princess of a land that we haven't seen yet. But don't worry, the series will still feature New Orleans. It will come to Disney Plus in 2023 and it will be a long form musical comedy series. If you guys have been around this channel long enough, you know I love musicals and I am obsessed with Tangled the series and I think this is going to be really similar. Also, I am really glad we are going to see Tiana as a human and not a frog. One of my main criticisms of The Princess and the Frog is that Tiana, the first black princess, was a frog for the entire movie. It was such a bad idea. I don't know why it got approved, so I'm so glad they're going to fix it. The fourth series is Moana, which I predicted months ago. I know, I'm amazing. The series will follow Moana's adventures as a wayfinder, journeying beyond the reef. It will be released in 2023, be long form, and again, a musical. I am so happy right now. This is definitely my favourite idea of all of the shows they revealed today. Moana is such an inspiring character, such a great role model, and the music is going to be incredible. The final series is an original series done by an outside company. Jennifer Lee said in the presentation that in 2019 she found a news piece about a group of storytellers and artists from Nigeria and Uganda. The title was Pan-African Comic Book Hopes to Kick Disney's I won't go on because I don't want to get demonetized. I'll let Jennifer Lee tell you their names because I cannot pronounce them. Tolu Olafoyeku, Ziki Nelson, and Hamid Ibrahim. Together they formed an entertainment company called Kugali. The goal of this company was to tell African stories through comics and animation. Disney has hired them to bring an all new animated long form series to Disney+. Plus. The series is called Iwaju which translates to the future. It is set in Nigeria and it will be science fiction. It will explore themes such as class, innocence and challenging the status quo. Which kind of reminds me of High School Musical. It will debut in 2022 and I'm really excited to see this diverse show. Anyway, that's all for this video. Let me know what Disney Plus show is your favourite in the comments down below. Please like this video if you liked it and please subscribe. I will be covering so much more stuff from the Investor Day so you don't want to miss out. Bye now and have a magical day.